Hey guys, welcome to Ego Unboxing, or in this case, Ego Unbagging. Um, I know what's in the bag, kind of becoming a theme. I but uh, I don't live with you. The madman has no idea what's in here. I'm hoping to uh, sell the contents of this bag to the madman. I hope he loves it that much. Um, probably won't. But these will be for sale. Um, if you do want to buy these, if he doesn't, message us at Wham Toys on Facebook. Uh, the the official sponsor of the unboxing uh, videos is there's a lot of cool toys collectibles and uh, great Christmas presents on there so uh, check that out Wham Toys on Facebook right this June yeah early, I'm already early like, Christmas oh, present I ain't got uh, kids bro you yeah. got like six or whatever it is but uh, pull one figure out once I pull it out you'll kind of get an idea of what's in the bag um, maybe we'll talk a little bit about them let Madman give us thoughts on it. And uh, I will let him dig in, blind God, bag style, right. pull out one bag. They're all in Ziploc. Oh, bags? Yeah. I like I'm grabbing a big Boom. condom. Hulk Hogan, Thumb Wrestler. LJN, uh, Hulk Hogan, Thumb Wrestler. Uh, these are mini versions of LJN figures. Um, they do have the thumb in the rear, or the hole to, in the rear. Why you got them in a sandwich bag? Uh, just to keep the paint from Somebody smashing them. together. Some, you can take it out, it's fine. Um, just, I didn't want them like rubbing oh, together. Can see them. Not in bad shape. But, I, got, uh, I got Hulk Hogan. You got Hogan? All right. He's got Hulk Hogan. Let's see if we can complete. Uh, I believe there were six or eight. I don't remember. Of the I got, set. I got Hogan and uh, actually him. Hogan and Hillbilly Jim. <laughs> Hillbilly. Awesome. Yeah. Well, think. then the cool thing is the I next four Hillbilly he will not have. Different than mine, I think. Well, that means you need to buy him. It's hard to tell. You think I'm eating? I mean, I don't know what your diet consists of. You are a large man. Well, I'm at Taco Bell. <laughs> so it ain't too much. So cool hillbilly gym figure. Alright, blind bag it again. Hell, I Boom. Can't they are with them. Oh, uh, Big John Stud. Big John Stud. You know uh, what movie he was in? No, I do not. And he's actually in a position where he'd be sitting on a bike. Harley Davidson and the Marlboro Man. Really? Have you ever seen that movie? I have, but I never noticed yes, it. Yes, he was it. the bartender. Who's the guy that uh, Harley got in a fight with? Okay, I had to go back and watch that. Yes. But, uh, uh, yeah. Paint on all these are really good. Uh, a lot of times you find them and they're not really good. There is one figure in here the paint's kind of shabby on. Um, not bad. Not overall not bad. condition is, I'd say, you know, great. Um, but I believe there's six figures. Is that JYD? JYD. Oh, he's got to pull JYD out well, of the pack. I'm trying to see. Wow, he's clean as hell. I, I told you, like, a lot of these are, I'm not going to say they're Sticky. mint. Sticky, what you been doing? I Dude, I have no idea. Like, uh, they probably need some love, probably need a, a, a figure bath, as old uh, Zack Ryder would say, get out the loofah and the bubble bath and give him a figure bath. Yeah, going to um, grab them cakes. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I did pull these out of an attic. They have been in an attic for about 30 years. Like so uh, I was up there for about an hour and I thought I was gonna pass out because it was about a million degrees inside that attic. Yeah, Mississippi's kinda hot right now. But uh, yeah, especially at three o'clock, uh, mid midday. Oh, and then we have, last but not least, Rowdy, Roddy Piper. He is in the worst shape as uh, he's missing the the route the hot rod has rubbed off his shirt yeah it looked like he tried um, to do the hogan tear and yeah. <laughs> didn't accomplish it well he wasn't he didn't have you know 27 inch pythons or whatever what year was this 1985 yeah i think they're all from 85 i believe there's a paul orndorff that is missing and that would complete uh, the set i think that's what it was because um, yeah. it is what five yeah, yeah five i believe total. there's a paul orndorff and that complete the set of six um but if you have Paul Orndorff and would like to uh, own the, the rest of the set, I can hook you up. So, JYD uh, is clean as hell. Man. JYD's really clean. Uh, John Studd looks really good. I'll show you him as well as Hillbilly. Hillbilly's um, in pretty good shape. Hogan has a little damage, his but not a lot. Little. But uh, you yeah, can his see the. the worst. Yeah. You can see the stars and stuff still here on his, um, on his sides. And then his face is in really good shape as well. Um, I don't know if that's gonna gonna come in, but overall, I mean, insert the thumb, and yep. you have the thumb wrestler. I watched the commercial for these earlier oh, today. Horrible. It's horrible, but it's really cool. Um, 
it's got the iron sheik in it he's like someone's staying after school or somebody's getting homework or something i don't remember what it is it's bad but uh yes yeah. 80s ljn 19 uh i believe we said 85 mm -hmm. yeah 1985 ljn thumb wrestlers uh like i say these will be on these will be for sale on wham toys on facebook um if you're interested in them just shoot us a message we can work something out so yeah. there's hillbilly he's in in really really good shape has a lot of paint still on him he has just a little there on his on his rear and some on his knee um for a very 20 year old toy yeah i mean overall phenomenal phenomenal shape Piper's definitely so, rough. Oh, these are 30 year old toys <coughs> that's why i said over 20 yeah. year old so uh i believe and I'm noticing now that there's that one has a one, this one has a two on it. That one has a two. I wonder if there's a series one, series two. I don't two. remember. God, or if, I was young when that happened. Or if this was like a. Yeah, because that's a one two. Or if this was a. Because uh, my Hogan's bandana looked a little bit. I think his bandana was red actually. And this one's white. Was you see a little excess paint that's left? Yeah. Or white. Yeah, I don't know if you can can mm -hmm. make that out. But see, there's a one A there. And then on no, the one C. John Stud, there is a D2. Let's see if you can, I can get that in the camera right there. So if you know what those are, let us know. Um, I'm kind of curious of what they are. But uh, overall, phenomenal figures, I believe. Yeah, very cool. So I still don't get your sandwich bag thing. But okay. Well, I don't want the paint. Like, if they rub together, I'm afraid it's going to rub more paint off. Yeah, I'm pretty so, sure uh, Piper's just screwed. Yeah. Um, however, I did watch a guy repaint some LGN, LJN yeah, figures. He was basically just a... And they did really well, so uh, he did a really good job. So, cool project, cool collectible. If you do not have these, definitely think check them out. If you have the whole set or if there's more thumb wrestlers, let us know them too because we're kind of new to the toy game. only one I've ever the seen, they're, game. they're just heads. They go in your thumb. And yeah. I didn't get that at all. So, uh... So you're like headbutting each other. Right. If you do have more of these, let, let us know which ones you have. And uh, if you know more about these, let us let us know that too. Because, again, we're still learning about uh, all the different toys and stuff. Your toy um, addiction. Yeah, I do have a toy addiction. And you can have one too if you visit Wham Toys. But, uh, hey, guys, thanks for watching this episode of Ego Unboxing. And, uh, hey, if you want to send us some toys, we'll unbox those too. So uh, just shoot us a message and we're making... You take, need a P.O. box. Yeah, yeah. well, I'll give you my address. <laughs> no, I wouldn't do that. I'll give you his address. No, I don't do that. So. No. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, check out Ego on Break. And uh, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Later.